that this video contains spoilers, but it's a Let's Play. All Let's Plays contain spoilers. So without further ado, let's roll that intro. Let's get right into this gameplay, guys. I'm excited. and Gretel. I used to read it to Callum when the electricity was shut off. Where Those is poor he? children. The whole world against them. The forest, the birds, the old witch, even their own parents. I used to imagine that Callum and I were the kids in that story. Not mother and son, but brother and sister, hand in hand against the unkind world. We were always hungry, looking for our own house made of candy. Looking for the sweetness that could take the pain away. Hunger leads people to desperate, terrible places where the tree branches reach like claws. Callum! <laughs> oh, you are up here. All right, little buddy. Now, I don't know if there's much exploration to do in this game. Like I said, it is short and it is heavily story driven and very, very narrative, I guess you could say. So I don't another accident. This place. Ooh, what up with the blood? Um Why won't you let me read that? Oh, there we go. Okay. Whoa, hey! You're Callum's bear! So you have a fucking knife in your eye. Can I go around and see that? Wow, okay, that's not cool. Congratulations, guys, at Funcom. No word of a lie? I have chills. Like, I have fucking goosebumps, and my fucking knees are all tingly. What about you guys? Let me know in the comments below. We haven't gone very far in, but I want to know if you guys are kind of freaked out too. Callum! Where did you go? This way, Mommy. Oh no, they got the creepy kid voice. Do not give me that creepy kid voice. Why am I walking like a peasant? Give me that run. Oh, we got another ride. Wait for mommy. Callum? This old thing used to make the blood run to my head. It'd make me dizzy. What do we got the here? guy just snapped. Those poor kids. A berserk. Oh, my God, that's fucked up. Where are you? No, don't say where are you. You were far too calm. You just read about a fucking mass murder, and you're like, oh, Kalu. Okay, we need to decrease this bastard. Okay, can we can we stop it? Come out, sweetie. All right, that should be it. Oh, we can ride it. 
Oh, I've got the heebs again. I know something's gonna happen, and it's gonna be weird. Somebody in there? Yes, there is. What is that thing? And he's gone. Creepy. Where are you? Callum. Okay, so I think we came down that way, if I'm not mistaken. So can we go this way? Actually, can I look at any of these? No. Callum, come back here right now! Okay, yeah, so we have to go this way. Won't let us go that way. I'm really nervous to turn around Hello? at times, too. Here. Where? Callum! Hello? Come on, Callum. Where did you go? Alright, so is it saying that we... There we go. Oh, I remember this. I look really weird in that. Almost looks like, uh... Fuck, what's that girl's name? Um, 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 Twilight Girl. Um, yeah, you guys are going to correct me anyway. But yeah, don't you find it looks like her? Lore. I don't know. Can't remember her name. Not important. Hello? Oh, Callum. Treachery hides in thoughts. Treachery that lashes like a whip and scars our insides. We got something in the, the building. first time I saw Callum... My thoughts betrayed me. I looked down at this wrinkled, red, bawling thing and I thought, is that it? We build our world from expectations and the world that I, I had that, built girl. for Callum was no different. He was so real, so there, and so far from my expectations. And they shattered, and as they fell in pieces, that one treacherous thought became a new foundation. All of the love that we shared, all of the warmth Whoa. and goodness that followed, built on a single, traitorous thought. Ooh, 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 ooh. Holy, that was... Oh, she's gonna jump out and scare me. Oh, fuck. Sorry guys, this is a this is a lot to read. I knew it. I knew you were going to do that. You guys can't see it. Maybe you can. Fucking goosebumps all over the goddamn place. Wait, Callum! Mother Duck said quack, 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 quack. 
Mother Duck said, quack, 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 quack. Callum, tell Mommy where you are. Catch me, Mommy. Come to Mommy, Callum. Oh, stop being a little creeper. I hate you. Constant crashes in 80s music. Guess it floats someone's boat. Oh, yeah, we're skipping the line. Boom, baby. What do we got? Nothing in the booth. Callum? Come back, Callum. Okay, so there's a car. Yes, so that car there has the lights on it. Gonna jump up and bite me, or am I supposed to get in you? Accident report. Dexter, the truck driver. what opened up the ability to go up here really good dynamic lighting too props to you guys it's a matter of public record that I am a failure as a mother once when Callum was very small I left him asleep in the car while I ran an errand don't even remember what it was when I came back the sheriff was standing next to the car watching my boy through the window not cool I didn't like what I saw in his eyes judgment he wrote me the ticket without saying a word. Just the scratch scratch of his pen on the notepad. When he gave it to me, our eyes met. I know what you're going through. My daughter, Helen, she... Just get some help. Help was a bolt of lightning. Help was a thousand volts surging through my veins. Help is agony. I'd rather die. I wanted to scream. I'd rather you pulled your gun and shot me. Wow. And instead my mouth said... Yes, Sheriff. Some of the narrative in this is fucking dark. Also, fuck, fuckity, fuck, 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 because I've been swearing a lot. I do that when I'm nervous. if you have to keep doing it or if you just need to do it once but I do it multiple times and we're gonna ride the ferris wheel and creepy stuff's gonna happen because that's what this game does that's what this game does to me it makes me freaked out it makes me slur my words it makes me jump but you know what all of that makes me happy because honestly I played until dawn I played like 20 something episodes of until dawn and yeah, I jumped at times, but I don't know. I don't see a lot of these jumps coming. People come it's into your life for a reason. More psychological. Dad used to say that before Mom ran off. After that, that he creepy. mostly just drank. Things were different for Don and I. When we met, I was sweeping the floor at Susie's diner. 
He came in with some workers, but he didn't try to flirt or cop a feel like the others. He just ordered a coffee and sat there, watching me. When my shift was over, he offered to walk me home. I don't know how to describe that walk. We talked and laughed and eventually kissed. It felt like love. It felt like a fairy tale. I can't tell you if Callum was made that night or one of the ones that followed. But I think it has to be that night. That one perfect night. Don and I moved in together, but then, well, he died. According to the supervisor, his safety harness failed when he was working on the top of the Ferris wheel. Don was there one moment, and then gone. Sometimes people leave your life for no reason. I was three months pregnant with Callum. Fairy tale fucking over. So if my significant other died on a Ferris wheel? Fuck if I'm getting on one, son. No way. I'm not getting anywhere near it. Also, remind me to buy some new jeans. These ones are all filled with holes. Oh. Creepy dude's back. You know who he reminds me of? Alright, so I'm pretty gassed. Wh what? Holy shit! I'm Satan's whore? Cool. Alright, let's keep running and let's see if we can't find Callum here. Now this game is fairly short as well, guys. We're looking at about maybe one to two and a half hours. It tells a fantastic